How's it going, everybody? Welcome back to Armored Core 6. So, continuing where we left off in the last episode, we reached the Coral Convergence mission. Uh, we have to go down here and deal with some of these um, things that are basically like a cross between a bone wheel skeleton and a wheel monk from Neo. These things are absolutely terrifying. See, they can shoot missiles, and if you're close to them, they can uh, kind of do a uh, flamethrower effect kind of thing. So, uh, so yeah, absolutely terrifying. Trying to get the jump on them, but they all know I'm here now. So, Let's see how this goes. Two repair kits remaining. I mean, if you can, if you can hit them with the uh, needle launcher, that's pretty good damage. Like that, it kind of knocks them over. And then didn't hit them with the Gatling guns, but I mean, they don't stay still for very long. Pretty hard to keep track of them too. If you have a tetrapod, I assume it would be a little bit easier, but okay. All three of those take care of. Whew. However, I do not have any <laughs> repair kits left. So that's a problem. This is a very cool area though. Probably one of my favorites so far, I'd say. I don't see if there's anything else down here. There's a big open area down here. There's gotta be more stuff. Uh, sketched by the famed artist STK, who perished half a century ago during the fires of Ibis, his style was assimilated by AI artists and with uh, time mimicry supplanted the real technique. Huh, that's kind of cool. So it's uh, image data. Oh, hello. You guys are kind of beefy, huh? I mean, either I didn't get all of that shot, or barely, Jesus, <laughs> barely took any damage from that. All right, let's try this again. Get this. Data. Oh. What the fuck? Oh god, more wheels? Are those the uh, ones that I killed before? Oh my god. <laughs> what is happening? Oh my god. Oh, there's a chest over here. The chest. Gimme. Oh shit, it's the moonlight blade. No! <laughs> My shining moonlight. Oh, Jesus, look at this. Archibus must be tracking us by now. Hurry, <laughs> Bounced off. <laughs> oh, man. 
from soft, you dirty, dirty birds. Put in a chest with the moonlight sword, guarded by three of these bone wheel, upgraded bone wheel things. Jesus. Like, ten times worse than bone wheel skeletons. Damn. Alright. Um, just run in here and grab this and uh, be on my way. Because I don't feel like dealing with these things. Okay, I got it. Go, go, go. Ew. Go, go. Ew. My energy. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, Jesus. Come on. No. Get up there. Whew. Okay. Damn. Ah. Uh, I should go get that image data again, but it is not worth it, dude. Those things are ridiculous. And those, like, other MT things that were down there. Like, extremely beefy, it seems like. Even more so than these guys. I don't know if I wasn't in the ideal range to hit them. My weapons or what, but damn. I bet they had a... I bet they had a combat log too, guaranteed. Those things, I don't know why they were so beefy. This place is crazy. If I never have to fight those wheel things again, it won't be too soon. Jesus. Getting into. The coral's rising. It's building up faster than I'd expected. Raven, I knew Walter was. Weapon AC. Oh my god, dude. Series. Still functional. Ida series? Looks like it has drones and shit. Oh my god. <laughs> what a job for you. Well, now I know where that. Oh my god. Now I know where that picture came from. 
saw a picture online of a meme picture of Melania in this thing. So this is Armored Core's Melania. Certainly looks like it. That pose, oh my god, I just got absolutely annihilated. Just getting a feel for the move set right now. This thing is nuts. But yeah, that oh my god. Yeah, that pose that it did at the beginning of the fight, like flying up in the air. It was a picture of this thing and Melania like doing the same thing. <laughs> it was pretty funny. Can see where it comes from now. Oh, okay. Yeah, I wanted to see. I wanted to see what kind of damage I could do with the needles. Okay, I can definitely do this. Damn! Look at that damage. There's gotta be another phase. This is this kind of damage is too easy. Kind of got you. Kind of have to get lucky with those hits though, because yeah, like that dodges the shit. Kind of another RNG fight. Again. Getting used to the attacks, kind of. So, certain ones. Almost got it. <laughs> Pulling some uh, guardian ape type shit in the water here. I can definitely do this. It's definitely going to take some time and a little bit of luck. Okay, there we go. Ah, I got hit by that. Done. Nice. That was an awesome first phase. Enemy core response. Could not have asked for anything better. I think if you use one repair kit in the first phase, you should be okay, hopefully. Alright, so hopefully we get lucky here. There's no way you can't go hitless in the... Or at least me. I can't go hitless in the first phase. There's no way. Okay, there we go. I got stunned too. I could have done more damage there. Oh, nice. Ah, 
Ah, I missed. Damn it. Oh. Nearly got it. Six to one. Come on. You're the only one who can finish the job. Oh, you're done. You're done. Yes. Nice. That was awesome. You know, that was actually a fun fight. If I wasn't doing that amount of damage, it, it might have been a different story, but shit. The cool resonance. It's fading. The machine's resolve. Inherited from its creators. Voices from the past. Fading into... What the... Oh, shit. It's one of those stun needles. Is that Archibus? Target neutralized. Ah, yeah, it's V2 Snail. You yes. son of a bitch. I left the subject alive as instructed. Who the fuck is he talking to? Only a fool would try to outfox Archibus. I'll see that the unruly dog is punished and brought to heal. Oh, and of course, let's not forget the hound's master either. You bitch. Whew, what a mission. <laughs> Damn. Aurora and my shining moonlight. I find it funny how the Moonlight Sword was just sitting there amongst the enemies, kind of like a demon souls in the nest of slugs. Archibus seized control of the coral. And its occupying forces swiftly commandeered the entirety of Institute City. There, they discovered a wealth of forgotten relics. Among them, experimental weapons that the Institute kept secret, fearing they were beyond human control. A group of sea weapons bearing the name of the Central Coral Control System. The Ibis series. Archivis also claimed a towering coral siphon, abandoned since the fires. The vascular plant. Now, they toiled to repair the plant and extend its reach beyond Rubicon's atmosphere. The Liberation Front no longer had the power to stop them. And the fires of war continued to smolder as the end drew near. Mm. Raven, I have found a message addressed to you. Decoding and playing back. Six two one. A friend of mine sent a request. Now, this one comes from me. You know what hidden dangers lurk within the coral. Fires of Ibis should have wiped the coral out, but it survived, gathered, and it's been steadily multiplying ever since. Now the coral convergence is growing at an exponential rate. Eventually, it'll spill out from Rubicon and contaminate space itself. The coral must be burned, 621. Even if that means reigniting the fire that scorched the stars. This isn't an order. It's a legacy. My fallen friends entrusted this duty to me. And now it's my turn to hand it on. 621. Feed the fire. Let the last cinders burn. I have one last job for you. Find your freedom. Raven. Now I find... 
finally understand what Walter was thinking. This AC... He must have foreseen this outcome and prepared for it. It's time for us to escape. Mm. Main system, activating combat mode. The fuck? You'll use an old gen AC instead of your usual craft. This AC is made from junk parts and its performance leaves much to be desired. Seriously? Just got through that? And now you give me a junk ass AC? <laughs> Showing us the way out. Look at this thing. All right, let's get going in our hunk of junk here. Ugh, I can't believe they put us on sewer duty. If that ancient piece of shit they're worried about. Is that an AC? Where'd it come from? Yeah, no kidding. That spread bazooka is kind of nice, though. Reminds me of, um, like the beginning of Sekiro. And, uh, beginning of Dark Souls, for that matter. Kind of waking up in a place and trying to escape. Would have been kind of cool if a game, uh, this game started out like this. Be very cliche, I guess. Jamming rounds. Huh. Okay. Can't lock on to you. That's cool. We're at a disadvantage. Let's find a way around them. If they okay. do spot you, your left hand weapon is equipped with gym rounds. Don't I didn't see another pathway over here. Maybe just gotta kind of slip by him. Go down that right hand path. I think that's what we gotta do. By him. You. Get back to work. Wait, they're not with us. In the sewers. I guess, uh, we should be thankful there's no poison swamp. At least not yet. Something over there, like a combat log or something. That's a big boy. I don't know, I don't know if I want to fuck with that thing. that and then come over here and grab this and say see you later here's our way back to the surface there we go this ac should have just enough propulsion i'll work it out is this oh my god yeah institute city this is b5 tater calling all security team members Oh, God. Um, so that wasn't a smart move. I have direct orders from B2 Snail. 
capture Raven and send the fugitive to the factory this time. Okay, I'm out. Unidentified AC! So let's not let them spot us. Okay, so no, we're going over this way. Got a bunch of them over there. Buildings. Nope. Still. Not enough. Okay. We go over here and then. Yeah, probably on this building. Okay. Up here. Come on. Ugh. Energy on this thing sucks. Take out that thing. Here. And up here. There we go. What's this? I've checked. It's not a trap. Okay. Uh, where are we going? Emergency beacon intercepted. Been a wild tourist. To see you're still kicking. Chief's coming to pick you up. Head to the rendezvous point. She's from RAD. She must be involved with Walter's mission. Where are we going? Oh. Beefy looking mech we there. The tourists AC too. Once we've caught our breath, let's talk. About Walter. Nice. 
That was cool. <laughs> Zero dollars. Got our old mech back. Yay. Jailbreak. We're gonna be using that shit. Augmented human C4621. Entering standard mode. Incoming comms. Back in your old AC? You were made for each other. The fact that you're still alive means that Walter made the right bet. All right. You deserve to know what we've been fighting for. I'll get you introduced with the next mission. Parts. All right. Well, I think that is going to do it for now, guys, looking at the time. So hopefully you're all doing well. We will continue on the next one. So stay tuned. More coming at you.